Now, in Banu, residents are protesting against the demolition of their properties while a circular road project claiming over 300,000 people will be displaced across six local government areas. They accuse the state government, led by Governor Jay McIndy, of being callous and uh, tyrannical and also even planning to use the land for private estates. The residents are concerned about the uh, financial and psychological impact of the demolitions, feeling betrayed by the government they voted for and condemning the move as inhumane and cruel. We have almost 224,000 houses marked for demolitions. And Governor, uh, sorry, the uh, estate agents are placing their signboard on those places that have been marked for demolitions. So we are begging Governor Shejima Kide to come to our aid, not to pretend that he don't know what is going on. He's our governor, he's number one citizen of your state. He should come to our aid. We are in trouble in Ibadan. But it's so sad that the government chose the lack of fairness and which has led to the displacement of thousands of residents in all areas across Ibadan, as we speak. So we want to assure everyone that we should remain steadfast. After this public hearing, after this press briefing, I'm telling you and I'm assuring you, unless I get into the government, we'll be coming up and mass, staying here, the main political will remain on the streets. The same way the same way the same way the streets are from our home, from our homes. We we'll ensure that our children are okay, we have no place to stay anymore. We indulge the other place out of assembly. The Urubado of Ibadan land, the Mandajis, and the one million people of Boya State to exercise their power to invoke checks and balances in government and intervene and throw this present administration into order. We also challenge the governor to publicly address the citizens of this state, stating clearly why he intends to take 500 meters to the right and 500 meters to the left, which amounts to one kilometer. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.